So what do we do? So in lower test, what's the first step do we do? Flex. Yeah, flex, flex board means 90 degrees and the first thing is then what do you do? No, before that. So you don't immediately sit on the food. You look for the posterior sex sign. Because in posterior sex, why is it important to look for posterior sex sign? So if the posterior cruciate ligament is injured torn, you'll get posterior sagging. So there'll be posterior sagging. So you look literally, inspect literally, see if there's any step off. You see, if one way to look is look at the tibial fibrosity. Look at the level of the tibial fibrosity. Okay. So if the tibial fibrosity is on line, means literally if you can only see one tibial fibrosity, meaning both tibial, bilaterally the tibial fibrosity is on plane, the same plane, such that they appear as a single uh, pointer, then there's no posterior uh, sex sign. So here you can see there's a posterior sex sign. Right? So if you inspect laterally, you see that there's a step off. Okay? So why is it important to check for posterior sex sign before you do the drawer test? Yeah, mainly it's false positive because when you have a posterior drawer uh, sex sign, the tibia is already the, uh, translated posteriorly. So when you sit and when you pull, there will be an anterior transla uh, translation. But what you're doing is basically you're pulling the posteriorly displaced tibia back to its default position. So for anterior draw positive to be uh, present, it must be from there must be an anterior translation from the default position. So when you don't inspect for the posterior sex sign, you just sit and you directly pull. You are just pulling it back to the default position. You are pulling back the tibia, which is already posterior displaced to a default position. But it will give you an impression as though there's an anterior translation. So it gives you a false, false positive result for anterior draw test. So here we. Keep that in mind because that's a posterior sex. Then after that, what do we do? After looking for posterior sex sign, we yeah, you sit go to maintain some courtesy. You want to maybe cushion the food. Okay. Better to cushion the food. Like. Then you sit and so why you sit on the food? Hold the food. So that is relaxed, fully relaxed. So you have to palpate for hamstrings. This time we just did for palpate for hamstrings. Make sure that he's not contracting the the hamstrings are lax. He palpate with hamstrings because this test must be only done when he's completely relaxed. Then where do you palpate? You place the two thumbs on the joint line. So how do you know as a joint line? So palpate like how we do the bony landmark palpation. So palpate from let's say you're starting from mid to shin tibia. So this prominence will be tibial fibrosity. Then you further go up, you find a consistency of. Uh, uh, soft consistency here that's the patella ligament so this soft area around the patella ligament this will be the lateral joint line medial joint line so medial joint line medial joint line soft 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 or everything is medial joint line and something which is firm here this will be the what collateral ligament okay so joint line joint line joint line joint line collateral ligament what collateral ligament okay so Joint line, joint line, joint line, joint line, collateral ligament, joint line, joint line, joint. So you just palpate at the joint line and wrap your fingers around the tibia and you put anteriorly, give a back and give posterior. So there's an excessive posterior translation as you notice. Okay? So do not confuse the anterior translation because you're just bringing back the tibia to its default position. So this is not an anterior draw positive. But it's a posterior draw positive. You can feel that there's a posterior translation of the tibia. Then you compare with the contralateral limb, same thing. Thumbs at the joint line. Make sure you the hamstrings are relaxed. Wrap the fingers around the tibia. Then thumbs at the joint line and you so there's no translation here. Okay, yeah, I can feel some translation here. Okay. Then 